do. Ooh, the screen looks dirty. That was weird. Ooh, it still looks dirty. That's weird. Good morning, good morning. Let's see, let's wait a couple minutes. Oh, Teresa is here on Facebook. Hello, Teresa. You're the first one here. That's the first name I've seen. This is a little scary. YouTube doesn't show any. Oh, there we go. Hi, Bonnie. That's weird. It says nobody's looking, but then I'm getting, um, nobody's watching, but then I get comments. So hi, Melody. Hi, Annette. Hi, Susan. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Poppy21. Hi, Sandy. Hi, Andy. Hi, Teresa in New York, in rainy New York. She said, hi, Polly. Hi, Russ. Good morning. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Marcy. Hi, Raleigh 8. Hello there. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Karen. Oh, okay. Charlie thinks I'm talking to her. So, okay. Can you jump up here? Okay. Come on. Jump. Can you? Ready? One, two, three, jump. Oh, okay. So, Charlie thinks I'm talking to her. So, she, hi, Corinna. Um, so, uh, Charlie wants to say hi. Charlie, can you say hi to everybody? Say hi, everybody. Say hi. Say, I'm going home to see my family later today. Huh? Say, I'm going home. Okay. You can just lay right here. Oh, big dog. I mean, she's not big, but she's bigger than cook. Uh, hi, Connie. Good morning. Hi, Teresa. Hi, Kathy in cloudy northern Ohio. Whoops. Uh, um, hello. Oh, somebody. Okay, hang on. Uh, okay. Hi, Bonnie. Good morning. Um, oh, wait. Somebody just asked me something. Uh, hello from sunny North Carolina. How are you feeling? Um, I'm feeling much, much better. I actually uh, did my walk run today, so I was very proud of myself. I did get up... Um, didn't get out of the house till 7.01, but I did get out of the house to do my little 45 minute, uh, whatever I do, three miles. Uh, so I did get to do that. But um, last week, yeah, last week I was just down. I was sleepy. Hi, Connie in Indiana. Hi, Dolores. Hi, Dolores in, um, in Puerto Rico. Hi, Karen. Oh, okay. Charlie, if you're gonna like be in my face, you gotta like at least go up so people can see you, huh? Say hi. So I'm holding her up a little here. Get your leg on there. Okay. So, ooh, whoops, what's going on? Okay. Um, hi, Barbara in Kansas. Hi, Judy. And a sunny, warm day in Maryland. Oh, it's cold here in California. Hi, Darlene. Hi, Cindy. Um, oh, hi, Olivia. Uh, circle postmarked. Will there be more? Um... There will be eventually. Yes, um, they're on. We we reordered them this morning, um, but yeah, those those went really fast. I was actually surprised the dies did not sell out on that one. Um, I have not changed the flash prices yet, just because I haven't had a chance. Um, but I wanted to show you, um, tell you that the large postmark to stamp dies have not sold out. And just a heads up, oh, your hair's long right there. Just a heads up, the circle disc that's in there is the circle disc that's also going to cut out the circles for postmarks and the personalized circles. So um, uh, Darlene says, thank you for doing my personalized stamp, but I noticed the format I used is gone. Yes or no? I don't know what that means. What format, Darlene? Um, a lot of times we do have people try to add emojis into the, um, I don't think this is what you're talking about, Darlene, but I saw a couple of people, Harmony says hi, thank you, Annette, hi back, um, uh, try to add emojis into the personalized stamps, and that ends up coming out a black square, because there's no emojis in um, computer fonts, so uh, just don't, don't add emojis, because then it, it kind of slows up your process, but... Um, Let's see. Um, yes, Annette said, yeah, Annette said I had it filled out and then it said it was not available. Yeah, I actually had to pull them from the website because we got um, so many orders and they do take a long time to process on our end. And so instead of having you guys wait longer than I want you to wait, I pulled them from, I pulled the quantities from the website. I'm hoping to add more, um, probably late this week. So make sure you click the notify me. It's still going to be only available to gold members for a while until I can kind of like catch up, um, and get like caught up a little bit. But, um, uh, oh, Corinna says she's in a meeting. <laughs> um, <coughs> excuse me, still have my cough. <coughs> excuse me. But, um, uh, so eventually we will have those back, but 
We had a couple people trying to add emojis. That doesn't work. Also keep in mind the circle postmarks are all in capitals in capital letters. Okay. We had a lot of people trying to do lowercase. Just so you know, um, you can type it in any way you want, but the computer's going to change it. So just a heads up on that. Um, let's see. Uh, but yeah, if you're interested in wanting, if you're wanting to get in on those, make sure you click the notify me because when they come back in stock, it won't be very many and you'll want to get it as soon as you possibly can. What buddy bag do you put your bottles of crystals in? I put them in the Edna bag, which the Edna bag now you can get, um, in pink. So that's very exciting. So yes, the Edna bag is what I use and it's in pink. The build your own stamp option. Um, Darlene, you'll have to email Phelan because I, I don't know, um, I don't know what the difference was, um, uh, regarding the order. So you'll have to ask, um, email Phelan and ask her because I, I, I don't know. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I placed an order on 428 and it still says processing. Is that okay? Let's see. 428, um, whoops, I'm looking at the wrong month. Sorry, I was like, whoa, wait. Um, 428, uh, depends on um, if you placed it Thursday night. Yeah, because that would have meant they only had one day to ship it. They don't work, they don't ship on weekends. They don't ship on weekends. So um, yeah, that would only give them one day to ship it. So yeah, I'd give them a couple more days to get a chance to ship it. Um, let's see, uh, would love Mother's Day and Father's Day circle die for cards. Oh, Debbie said, um, possibly not this year. It's too late for this year, but maybe next year. That would be good. Um, cards by DeCaro says those new crystal gems are amazing. Can't wait for the new sets to come out. Let me tell you, I am in love with the crystals. Uh, they're, they're literally diamonds. I just love it. Um, I just absolutely love it. Baby Harmony has a cold and a runny nose. Oh, and she's only six months old. I'm telling you, those babies catch everything. Even even when they're babies, they catch everything. Um, are we getting a card die this month in our card kit? Um, I don't remember. I did the videos about two weeks ago. I can't remember. Isn't that weird? Isn't that horrible? I can't remember. I don't know. I don't know. It'll be a surprise. Um, Anna says, hi, Stephanie Cookie. Um, actually, this is not Cookie, Anna. This is uh, Charlie, my... What are you? Are you my niece? I guess she's my niece. So this is Charlie. Hang on. Let me just zoom her down so you can see her. Charlie, look up. Say, hi. I'm a big, I'm a big version of Cookie. Yes, yeah, so Charlie weighs a ton. Well, compared to Cookie. Cookie weighs six pounds. I look I look short on this one. There we go. Um, Charlie uh, weighs a lot more. And um, she doesn't understand why I'm talking to the computer. So she's um, in my face. So can you say hi? Hi, everybody. Oh, oh, you almost opened your mouth. Here, here. You know what? I wonder if Ben is Ben. Why isn't your brother watching, huh? Say hi, everybody. I'm a sweet dog. I'm a good dog. I'm a better dog than Cookie. Oh, don't let Cookie hear you say that, but it's true, huh? Oh, Cookie. Oh, don't look at me like that. You are. You know you're a naughty dog. We love you, but you're a naughty dog. So, oh look, Charlie's just trying to lay on me. Isn't that sweet? See, look. Isn't she a nice? Look how nice. Do you think they'll notice if I if I keep this one and um and give them cookie? So yeah, she's a sweet dog. The first night she got here, um, they uh, she's never stayed with us before. The first um, night she got here, Ken's like, "Where's the dog?" And I'm like, "Uh, she's laying here in bed with me." And he's like, "She is not allowed in our bed." So um, it, but it was funny. She literally jumped on the bed, huh? You're, you're, she's, she's a good dog. She only barks when Cookie barks. She's a really, really good dog. She's got kinky hair though. She has a fro. She's got kinky hair. I think she's going to need a groom pretty soon, <laughs> but okay. That's enough for the dog. Um, she's actually a rescue. I, she's probably got a little doodle in her poodle doodle, some, something in there. Um, she was a rescue and, uh, they were on a, um, they were on a waiting list for, I think there was 300 people in the law in the lottery for her and one other dog. And um, uh, Ben and, and this is back like in the like beginning of the, um, it was like July of 2020 
when, you know, you couldn't get out of your, so they're all in the car and Ben and Carter and Marcella prayed before the raffle and guess what? They won and they won Charlie and it's because they prayed, huh? It's because they prayed for you, huh? So yeah, like out of 300 people, they got, um, they got, uh, they got Charlie. Somebody said, hang on. Uh, Diane says, us doggy people are hilarious. We talk to dogs. Oh, yeah, you guys should hear me on the walks. I'm like, okay, ladies, it's time to go in. As soon as we get home, then we're going to blah, blah, blah. And I talked to him for like 10 minutes. So, um, yeah, she's a very good, this dog is a very, very good dog. And Cookie, don't, hey, don't be mad at me. Come here. Hey, psst, psst, psst. come here. Now she's a leaving because she's mad at me. Cookie, mommy loves you. Come here. I love you still. Come here. Okay, go play with Cookie, because she's sad. Ugh. She doesn't like to share her mommy. Okay, um, let's see. Um, hi, Quilty. Hello, hello. Oh, so is Nancy here yet? Nancy, are you here yet? I want to talk about you, but I don't want to wait to make sure I know you're here. Cookie is jealous, Carol. Yeah, she's like giving me the evil eye right now. She's probably going to go pee on my bed or something. Um, hi, Loretta. Luckily, she can't get on my bed because she's too small. But Cookie, mommy loves you. Oh, God. Okay, so let's see. Um, oh, one thing. Um, uh, the the um, have I been working on my cricket? No, actually, I've not. Um, it just literally sits there because it's on like a little. Um, uh, what is this called? Oh, Nancy is here. Oh, good, Nancy. Good, thank you. Um, it's on a um stool for my island because I might see. I don't know if you can see my other island. See, see, I have the other stool right there. Um, and so it's just always right there. It's probably not a good spot for it because it's always in the sun. But I have a love-hate relationship with it because I don't like the, um, software that it comes with. It's very annoying. Uh, Russ, I still am in pain with it. I hate it. Okay, um, so Nancy, oh, hang on. Let me go get the, I don't know if I, but the card, Nancy sent me a card. Hang on, where'd it go? <clears throat> oh, here it is. So Nancy sent me a card. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, a swirl card. And I love it. And it says, one of a kind just for you by Gator Lady. Because she's named Gator Lady. And look, she has, it says thanks in there. And Nancy is a sewer. Is a sewer. And she is a professional. I'm just saying. And she made bags for everyone. Like a long time ago, she made, not a long time ago. But a while back, she made bags for um, me and I got to share them with the kids. Russ, I'm telling you with the design space, I just like, I guess the problem is, is I, I use illustrator every single day. And so it's not the same as illustrator. And that's where my problem is. I think that's my problem. Um, Teresa says, Stephanie, I agree. And you understand computers. Yeah. I, I mean, I like deal with computers every single freaking moment of my life kind of thing. <laughs> So it's really, yeah, Nancy is very talented. So let me, let me talk about this. So she made bags for Katie, my daughter, Kirsten, my daughter, made cute little bags for the babies. And I, I can't believe I don't have them. The babies took them away from me. They have them already. Um, then she made bags for Faylene, Dina, and Maria. And she said the three of them could um, choose which ones they want. So... She made this one. Oh, and I don't know. I didn't get to grab all of it because they they took some of it already, Nancy. But she made this cute bag for K Kirsten, KJ. And cute little pockets. And KJ is more of a muted girl. Like, she's more of a, you know, quieter, like, you know. So she actually, Nancy, just so you know, took one of the other bags. Because I said she could. So she got that bag. Then they all started trading. Okay, so then what happened was look at what she made for Katie. And Katie was like slobbering on this. I can't believe I still got it back. Um, this is an apron that she made for Katie. Because you guys all know she Katie likes to um likes to uh sew. I mean not sew, cook. I'm gonna wear it because it's easier. So, but look how cute it is. And Nancy, I did get pictures of the babies too, don't worry. I mean, of the, um, of the Moriam and Cookie's not here, Polly. She's, 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 ugh. okay. Then she made 
oven mitts. Okay, you guys, Nancy made this, made it. Okay, look, look at the stitching. You guys, it is perfect. My mom's like, my mom saw it, you guys. And my mom's like, she didn't make that, Stephanie. She bought it. And I said, no, mom, she told me she made it. I go, look, my mom's like, Stephanie, no, look at the stitching. She didn't make it. And I go, she goes, my mom's all, she bought the fabric like that. And I go, mom, mom, Nancy would not lie to me, mom. She made it. It was so funny. But look at the stitching, you guys. Can you see the quilting stitching on there? Like, I mean, the lines, you know? Okay, so Katie was like, all, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. So then she made Katie a matching bag and a bottle holder. Okay, well, the problem is, Nancy, I had that feeling came over yesterday. And I had that bag next to the other bag so Phalene could pick the other bags, you know, that she was supposed to pick. And she's like, I want the strawberry bag. That wasn't hers. And I said, oh, she goes, I really, this one's my favorite. And I'm like, mm. long story short, Phalene took the strawberry bag. Katie said it was okay because she already had the strawberries over here. So now Katie's going to pick one of the other bags. But really quick, because I just want to show you guys how awesome it is. How awesome Nancy is. So Nancy made this bag also. So Maria and Dina are going to pick. She also made um, cup holders. And oh gosh, did I not grab a cup holder? Oh, here's one. Matching cup holders for everybody. And Katie's like, how did she know I'm a hiker and I need a, and I need one? And Nancy does need an Etsy shop. Nancy, post your um, sister-in-law's Etsy. Um, so, and then look at this. So then the babies have one matching like this. I mean, that matches theirs unbelievable there's this cute bag here there are so many awesome bags you guys and mostly and then katie and kirsten are like oh this will be perfect because in california you're not allowed to um you have to buy uh, bags if you go to the grocery store to get your groceries in so the girls are like oh this will be perfect in the in the trunk so then i have a bag so i don't have to buy a bag so she is amazing oh pamela don't worry i took care of her <laughs> so i actually put nancy on a special project so we will be seeing that someday. So thank you, Nancy, from the bottom of our hearts. The girls will all thank you. Eventually, Maria and Dina will get theirs, but we're, we're, we're celebrating these bags. They're amazing. Wow, I know. They, they are awesome. Oh, and she, oh, I'm sorry. And she made a stroller bag for the kids. Nancy, I took pictures of the stroller bag. It fit perfectly. Um, it goes around their double stroller perfectly. Oh, we used it on Friday, as a matter of fact. So, but thank you, Nancy, from the bottom of my heart. She's awesome. She's amazing. Gator lady. She's awesome. Now, really quick, something I forgot to mention. The, I still haven't taken the um, flash seals off because I forgot. But one thing that did not show up well on the computer. Hang on, I'm just checking really quick. One thing that did not show up well on the computer and I'm really sad because it didn't sell well, which I mean, that's fine. But is the stitched envelope background die. It did not show up well at all on the website. In fact, I even changed the picture, but it does not photograph as well as it really is. So I'm going to show you three samples of it. I know once you see it, it more, you're going to really wish you had it. It's still on flash sale. I want you to consider it, okay? Because I know you're going to want it later. But here it is. Look at the background. Here, you can see it on video better. Look at the background die. That's the die we're talking about. It has those cute little envelopes. And I'm leaving it on flash sale for probably the rest of the day. Just because I, I want you guys just to know that this one is, is more awesome than you realize. It's just... Um, it didn't show up well on the computer. So, oh, Wilma says that's the only thing I bought. See, and and, and it's, it's a really, really good one. I just don't think it photographed well on the computer, on the website. Here's another one. Um, so I was kind of sad when I saw that it didn't sell very well because I'm like, oh, it's because the picture sucked. I'll be honest, the picture sucked. Um, and I even changed the picture because I was like, okay, that's not even a good picture. But look at how cute that is, especially inked. And then here's one that's a little bit more subtle, but look how cute it is. And so I just want you guys to see it because I know some people are going to go, oh my gosh, I totally should have gotten that. But just a heads up on that. Also, look how cute this is. This is an example of the circle extra. This one says sending you paper hugs. 
um, and then they, they put the icon in the center, Happy Meal. So um, eventually those, this circle uh, personalized will be back in stock, just a heads up. I'm doing the best I can on that one. Whew, it's crazy, but um, just a heads up on that one. Um, that envelope background die is really awesome. It's still on flash. I'm gonna leave it on flash for a little bit longer. Um, I just think the picture didn't show up very well. And, oh, sorry. And that kind of like bummed me out because um, it's a really awesome one. I see myself using it a lot and that's all I'm just saying. So just so you know, okay? Heads up on that one. Um, Sandra, you're so sweet. I love that. And that said she got it. Yeah. Um, Anne Marie says I bought the whole new set. Yeah, it's it's pretty it's it's pretty awesome. The my favorite part of it is the circle postmarks and then the ability eventually for everyone to be able to buy the personalized. So just to give you an idea on the personalized ones, we've been getting a lot of cute ones like from my gnome to yours, uh, special delivery, snail mail, snail mail by, and then a name, um, hand, handmade for you, love always, Graham. Also, when you are able to buy the circle stamps, make sure you pick an icon. The icon is not, in, is not it's, it's extra, it's free, it's free but it's a separate stamp. It's not part of your circle. So some people were saying none. I'm like, wait, that should not be an option <laughs> because you have, I mean, you don't want a big circle blob, you know? So, um, uh, let's see. Uh, hi Debbie. Hello. Oh, just landed in Chicago from Oakland. Prayers for her mom. Oh, she's in intensive care. Oh, Debbie. Oh, Debbie. Debbie's mom. I'm sorry. In, in Chicago. Oh, I hope it's warm in Chicago at least. Um, that oh, can we have a pumpkin for the center? Is there not a pumpkin option? Oh my goodness! I'll have to add a pumpkin. Yeah, I can't believe we don't have a pumpkin. Lois says prayer request. Um, my dad had a bad fall about a month or so ago. Long story. I'm now staying with him until further notice. Oh, Lois. Yeah, absolutely. Lois, dad, fall. Oh. Um, going to use the small icon sets for the center. Yes. So, um, the small, the small icon set, there is another one coming for new items, a new item one. So that one is real. That's going to be really exciting. Hi, Pam. You have an awesome day too. You do. You too. Um, will we be adding more circle stamps for the dies? Um, there's a good possibility uh, because the circles from Postmarks completely sold out. So we will be reordering those. But um, there's a good possibility we will because I was just having way too much fun with those. I mean, I really, really, really had fun. Will the card club um, be the same theme? Yes. Card club uh, is always loosely based on the um, stamp and Die Hard. Loosely, I say, just because it, like some of the paper and a couple of the, a couple of the embellishments will usually match and there will be uh, probably cutouts for that one. So the personally stamps will be back in stock. Um, and, uh, it's just a matter of, uh, time. Make sure though, for those of you that are just joining us, make sure you click the notify me because I'm not going to say, okay, a hundred people can order now because it'll just like, crash it again. So, um, make sure that you order, I mean, make sure you click that notify me and, and, and get it if you want it now. Can you explain about the large postmark die again? Oh yeah. So the large postmark to stamp dies, that has the XO, XO and the wavy lines. The main die in there that you're really, really going to want is the circle. The circle, because it cuts out perfectly the circles for postmark stamps and also the circle personalized stamps that you can buy so that's really good because it will allow you to when you have one made if you have a personalized made it'll allow you to cut it out now the nice thing about the square one is everybody has squares already right so um you'll be able to um just have that done and and you know you everybody has square dice you can die cut that um, what is the size of the circle stamps? Um, couldn't tell you because I don't think I have. Oh, wait, I could kind of measure this one. Where'd that one go? 
I can kind of measure this one. Uh, let's see. Uh, bah, 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 bah. <sighs> Roughly one and a half. I would say one and three fourths, roughly. One and a half ish, roughly. One and three fourths. Um, if you want to go centimeters, which is much easier for me, it's about 42 centimeters, 43 centimeters. That's not true. Millimeters. Millimeters. Sorry, I only deal with millimeters. Um, so 43 millimeters. Oh, okay. Um, so the square one, we can order what we want it to say with our name. Yeah, Bonnie, it's not available right this second, but yeah, you they, I can say anything you want. Both can say anything you want. Um, but uh, make sure you click the notify me so you get a um, get a information on um, uh, when it comes back in stock because there's not it's I'm not going to be able to release them completely. You'll have to, um, you'll have to click the notify me. Um, any sneak peeks on the class coming Wednesday? You're going to love it. That is the only sneak peek. I actually did a video for it. So Kenny will be posting the video soon. I believe it's coming on sale, what, Wednesday? I think Wednesday, late tomorrow night. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but it's, it's pretty, um, it's pretty awesome. Hang on. Um, does the circle die work for shakers? Um, yes, it would as long as you, it's it's only one die though. So you would need to have a circle roughly the same size to do the window, and it would work for the foam and the frame. But it only it only has the big circle. It I mean the the ring. It, I should call it a ring. I should I should call it a ring. Um, we really could use videos from one of your design team when you have new releases, looking at their cards is helpful. Um, they sometimes do videos every once in a while. They'll, they'll do videos. They, um, they, they, um, they're, they're paid, but they're not paid. You know, I mean, we, um, video videos, uh, those of you that do videos, they are, they, they take a long time to do a long time to do. Um, um, Bonnie says, I'm sleep deprived, so why do we want the personalized to be die cut? Um, Bonnie, like if you were to be put, like here, here's an example. Um, Linda has one, an older one from another company, and she always die, uh, die cuts it and has it there. She also, um, or you could have it like already done, already die cut, and then you could add it later. Like if you, um, you know, sometimes I actually like do too much on my card, and then I can't stamp the back because it's too... Um, to bumpy um so you could add that on there if you wanted to um linda says the die for the circle is one and seven eighth thank you linda linda would know she has one <laughs> um uh have you ever thought about making fireflies as a stamp in different sizes that would be really cute um we have just a fake firefly in one of the frog ones but fireflies would be cute um, I don't know exactly what fireflies actually officially look like, so I'd have to go. Um, I'd have to go look that up um, because you never know. Uh, let's see. Um, okay. Um, does Nancy have a shop for the things that you showed? Nancy, um, did you post your? I think she said her sister-in-law has an Etsy store. I told her she needs to start selling stuff because oh, that stuff is awesome. that that stuff is awesome um so yeah um you need to go um need a thanks or thank you fold it i had a thanks a long time ago margaret and a thank you is definitely coming definitely coming um lightning bugs yes yes we don't have those in california we don't have fireflies or lightning bugs in california um so nancy says no my sister-in-law does so Nancy, you need to figure out, find out what her name is so we can post it so people can know because that would be a really fun thing to, um, to, to have people be able to buy stuff if they want to. Um, any idea when the stamps will be back in stock? The personalized? Um, I'm hoping the end of this week. Uh, make sure you click the notify me though because um, it will be limited. 
it will be limited just to make sure that I'm able to um, keep up. Um, whoops. Uh, could you use the Happy to Be Circles club set with the club set with the die cuts? Uh, Diane, I don't know. Ask in the um, ask in the fan page and see if somebody has those that they can test because that would be good. That would be good. Um, let's see. I know. I know. Oh, Sandra says she knows them as lightning bugs too. Um, Melody says, my friends just adopted a baby girl. She needs that bag and Bambi material. That is their thing. Oh, how cute. How cute. So yesterday, I'm going to tell you a story. Yesterday, Katie t called me. And as if you guys ever paid attention to anything I've ever, ever said, we do not call each other in our family. Um, my parents do. But my kids know, don't call me unless it's something. I mean, they know, they don't call me unless something's wrong with it wrong with them right and um like the time kirsten was in the emergency room um having um a, her appendix taken out uh so um kirsten katie out of the blue called me yesterday and i'm like hello she goes i'm okay and i said okay she goes but i'm having a problem and i go what her friend was driving down the street and he saw a kitten in the middle of the street and so he literally stopped his car and got the baby kitten and put it on his lap and started to drive away because obviously the kitten would have been a pancake, right? Um, and so he was driving away and the kitten got off his lap and managed to get into the steering, where his steering wheel is up and into where the steering wheel column is. So he immediately pulled over and the kitten would not come out. So the kitten was stuck, I guess like where your dash is, where your steering wheel column is. He, the kitten got in there and would not come out and he could not get the kitten out. So of course he calls Kate because Katie is the cat lady. And Katie's literally calling me from the phone, telling me, what do I do? What do I do? And I'm like, okay, he can't get there. He can't reach the kitten. He, no, no. I said, okay, this is what you do. You make sure the car's off, obviously. It was already off. And shut all the doors, get out of the car, and leave the kitten there. The kitten will come out when the kitten is not scared. And so I think it took like 45 minutes the kitten did finally come out, and this kitten, let me just tell you, is the cutest kitten I've ever seen in my life. The most beautiful eyes, little tiny, tiny baby. Luckily, and I said, oh my goodness, and I said, please, Lord, don't let Katie take this cat. Please, Lord, don't let Katie take this cat. Please, Lord, <laughs> because... Um, Katie already has two kitties and you know, one more and, and yeah, okay. And we got a little, got a little worried about that kid. So I said, is he going to keep the kitty? And she said, yes, that he was going to keep the kitten and the sweetest little, I will have to, maybe on Thursday I'll show the picture of the kitten because I can't because it's on my phone and my phone's behind us. I mean, my phone's recording. But let me just tell you, this kitten, I would have taken it if I was a cat person. I'm no longer a cat person. Um, I've discovered that with twins, I am no longer an animal person because I have two little animals named Liam and Miller. Um, maybe when they grow up a little bit, I will be more of an animal person again, but I have my hands full. Let me just tell you this kitten, you guys, I cannot wait to show you on Thursday. Remind me, someone's got to remind me on Thursday to show you the picture. Luckily, her friend has a heart of gold. He is an angel and he is keeping this baby girl. I, I don't know if it's a girl or boy. She's so pretty. I think she has to be girl, but he's going to keep the kitten. And so happy ending for all, you know, how we, they always say, you know, you don't choose your cat, your cat chooses you. Well, this is perfect example. Does Cookie like cats? Dawn, Cookie loves cats. 
loves cats. When she, when Katie got butter, we were so excited. We went over there and butter went nuts. Um, so cookies not allowed at Katie's house, but cookie loves cats. We used to have, um, um, you know what? This kitten is literally this big and it was in the middle of the street. Um, I can't imagine how a kitten could get out. I have a feeling it was not in a good part of town and I have a feeling somebody dumped it. Um, what did he name the kitty? I don't know, but whatever kind of car he has, that's the kind of name. Like if he drives a Toyota, he needs to name it Toyota, right? Or Camry, name it a Camry. I don't know. I have to ask KJ, Caitlin. I have to know. Is the kitten old enough to be away from mama? Yes. It is, old, Elizabeth, it does look old enough. I mean, I don't know how old it is, but it does look old enough. Um, we actually, when I was a kid, I found, not a kid, I was 19, but I found um, a kitten uh, that uh, was too young to be away from its mother, but the mother had left it. And I actually um, had to, had to um, I, I had long fingernails at the time, and she, I would put milk in my fingernail, and she would literally suck my, my fingernail and get the milk off. And good old Boo Boo lived a good 17 years at our house. So, um, yeah. But um, Russ says the other cat, the, the other saying is cats don't have owners, they have servants. Yes, and that's why Ken doesn't like cats. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, have its eyes changed color or are they still bluish? Sharon, I couldn't tell what color. I, they almost looked blue at first, but they looked more green. When I looked at it again, they looked more green. So um, I, I'm hoping to get to meet the kitty just because it's so beautiful. Um, but uh, absolutely beautiful little kitten. So it was a good story, and and I was happy. I'm happy to report that good story because um, you know it's always nice to hear good things in the world, right? Because oh, you need good things in the world. Um, so let me see. Um, Oh my gosh, Deneen says, when I started watching and being a Gold Club member, I thought you were the mother of the twins. No way, you look too young to be a grandma. Well, bless you, you're my new best friend, Deneen. Wow, um, what color fur? Actually, it must be a girl because I think it's a calico. I think it's a calico. Um, I'll, have to, I'll have to get the picture. But um, Deneen, that is very kind of you to say. Um, backstory, I met my husband when I was 16 and I had two weeks after I turned 16 and uh he was my first real boyfriend and I was not his first real girlfriend though uh he was older he was 18 and a half and uh we actually got married when I was 19 I was a teen bride and I had my daughter when I was 22 our first daughter and then my second daughter when I was 26 um so yes um but uh, Deborah says, well, you changed my mind. I just went and bought the rest of the add-ons. Deborah, you know what? I'm, I'm, in all honesty, that's why I just wanted to talk about this background one. Because I know when you guys really see it, you're going to wish you had that background one. Um, it's one of the few that I really like go, oh my gosh, you really kind of need that one. Because it's just gorgeous. And later in the year, you're going to wish you had it. Probably shouldn't say more than that. But, yeah, you're going to be happy you have it later in the year. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying. Melody said, I found one. She was five weeks, and we had her for 21 years. Oh, hi, Sally Joe in Colorado. Can use in envelope flaps. Oh, how cute would that be? That would be cute. Um, uh, oh, that's cute. Um. Do you have the sample of the one they cut the envelopes out? I love that one. I don't. I just grabbed these three. The others are um, packed. Not packed, but away. Um, but yeah, they they are really... I got the background this morning along with some add-on stamps. Yay, Karina, you're gonna. I'm telling you, you're going to love that one. It's fun. It's a good one. It's a good one. Um, I'm trying to think what the babies did this weekend. Uh... Did they do anything funny? They're learning how to do their scooters. They're learning how to do their scooters. And let me just tell you, it is the cutest little thing. They go and they go and then they hit a couch. And then they like, kind of like look around like, what the heck? 
And I'm like, well, you've got to turn around because they haven't learned how to steer or anything because that's, that's kind of like above their age level yet. And so they get their, their scooters and they, uh, 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 and they have to turn it around and then they turn it around. I mean, the scooters are bigger than they are, by the way. Like Miller's hands are like this and he's like barely seeing over the scooter. And it is just absolutely, oh, Russ, you're so funny. He just ordered the envelope die. I'm telling you, Russ, you're going to be happy you did it. And, it, and it's so cute. And, and so they, go, they play on their scooters. And my parents came over on Saturday. So then they were showing off for Grandma and Papa. They were like zooming in the house. And it was the cutest thing. Um, it was, Linda says, best release ever. My goodness. Thank you, my love. I love that. Um, you're going to have fun with that heart. The, I'm, I'm sorry, not the heart. The, um, the club set. The club set's good because you're going to be able to add other things in there, right? I mean, of course, I offer, I give you the present in there. And then also the add-on set was the barn scene and also the island scene. But you guys, add Cookie Dog in there. Add, actually, somebody's got to remind me. Maybe I should do that in the video on Thursday. I want it, I, on Thursday, hang on, I'm going to write this down. On Thursday's Crafting Corner, I'm going to use the stamp um, postage stamp and I'm gonna use like a different stamp but I'll make a mask and show you like how to do all of that um, just to remind you how to do that because I know most of you know how to do that but using a different stamp so you can really see that like you're gonna use that postage stamp for like way more than you think you're going to um, and then Anne-Marie says will you be making more inside stamp picture stamps that I don't know I don't know if I will let's see how the um, consensus goes if we get a lot of requests for that we'll see um I mean I kind of think I don't know I don't know I don't know I honestly don't know because I really want you guys to use the ones you already have um you know that's kind of how I like to do it I always like to make sure that you're going to go back and use the stuff that you bought last year from us I want you to use it on this so I'm going to do that on Thursday and I want to show you how awesome it's going to be because then I think you guys are going to go oh yeah you know what I mean um, so, uh, can you do the reverse stamping technique Thursday? Um, you mean using the palette for mirrors? Um, if that's what you mean, let me know. Um, uh, I might not be able to do it on Thursday, but I can show it real quick. If that's what you mean. Um, Teresa says, add me to your prayer list, please. I'm going for a heart catheterization next Thursday. Oh my goodness, Teresa. Yeah, wow. Oh, oh my goodness, girl. My goodness. Quilty says, I think you can make a picture stamp out of most stamps we already have. That's true. That's true. Um, will regular size pudgies fit in the stamp like the present does? Um, that is a good question. One of my design team members will have to look that up and see. I don't know. I don't know off the top of my they might be a little too fat. But but that all being said, cut them off a little bit, right? Because that would be cute. It, they don't have to like totally, it doesn't have to perfectly frame them because then, you know, it, it, you know, cause like, if, for example, on the, on the, hang on, let me pull it up. Cause I want to, I want to be able to like explain it on the, um, where is it on the, like the, the barn, you know, it kind of like goes off, like the sun goes off. Um, and on the island one or the beach one, you know, beach, of course, you know, I'm doing a beach, but like the sand goes off the edge. It doesn't like literally frame it, right? It doesn't completely frame it. So definitely, you know, think outside the box on the, oh, no pun intended, because it's kind of like a box, right? Um, so think about that. Think, definitely think about that. Um, uh, sorry, I was looking at something else. Okay. Okay, sorry. Ooh. Um, I get a little, I get a little, um, yeah. Um, mini pudgies would definitely fit. Oh, the mini pudgies would definitely fit. So, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Are you, um, can you think, please think of making season full at spring, summer, fall, winter, um, that's a good idea, Ponzi. We have quite a few words coming up, but I can definitely add that to the, um, uh, to the wish list. Uh, 
Hi, Gloria, my love. Hello, hello. Um, yes, and Pamela says maybe you can turn it the other way because it's wider than it is tall. Absolutely. So yeah, so it, the stamp is both ways, right? So that's one good thing about the present is going to be tall, but if you turn the stamp the other way, then the island and, I keep calling it an island, the beach, and the barn will fit um, sideways, right? So yeah. Okay, I'm trying to think if there was anything else I wanted to tell you really quick because I got to head out. My mom's at the emergency dentist right now because, oh my gosh, if I showed you guys the picture, she'd kill me if I showed you the picture. But she got a, a infection in her tooth over the, like Thursday and she thought it would go away and her face like literally puffed up like this much. And so she had an emergency, um, um, emergency dentist appointment today at 8 30 and I haven't heard from her yet so I'm very concerned so I need to contact her and find out what's going on but um will you be releasing the slimline lattice that was on HSN yes um Connie it is on the schedule I don't know when but it will be definitely the 25th because whenever we re-release it'll be on the 25th but yes it is it is on the schedule it is definitely on the schedule oh Gloria says she's gonna pray for my mom thank you my love thank you um it, um, I, I think she's going to be okay. I, I'm sure she's going to be okay. Thank you, Reagan. Thank you. So my friends, I need to head out. Um, I have a lot to work on today, but, um, I think I got everything out. Sometimes I forget, but Thursday, five o'clock Pacific, 8 PM Eastern, we will be doing our crafting corner. We'll be talking about the postage stamp a little bit more. So heads up on that couple more a uh, little bit while longer I'll have those flash sales on so if you did want to get the background dye or anything like that um go ahead and do it now um the I am I'm sorry um the personalized had to be cut off for a little bit please make sure you click that notify me so you get the notification right away um they will go fast when they come on because I'm only going to put on a certain amount and then I got to shut it off again because I got to make sure we don't um it says 12, it's going to be a 12 week wait. It will not be a 12 week wait. Um, it, it's, that's, that's on there. So we don't get in trouble. <laughs> Meaning, you know, so we don't get too behind, but I mean, we're looking at, I, I would think six weeks is good, is a good estimate. Um, but I don't want it to be too horrible. Um, Stephanie says, if you sign up for the club sets, will you get the current set? Stephanie? Yes. If you sign up today, you will get the postage sent to you automatically. Um, it's the postage to stamp. And then the di the second you sign up, you can go buy anything you else you want at, at um, flash sale prices and club discount. So you'll get the double discount. So sign up. If you're going to do it, sign up like in the next three hours to make sure you get those flash sale prices also because then you get the double discounts, which are even better, right? because then you get two discounts. <laughs> okay, my friends, thank you all so much. Um, please make sure you like and share this. I appreciate that. But thank you all so much. Thank you for your love, your support, and your prayers. I love this community. I love that we just get to spend some time together every day. Make sure you join our Facebook fan page. Um, go to Facebook and search um, Official Stamps of Life fan page. It's an amazing group of humans, and uh, it's a very positive place to be. We always need to find positive places because, you know, it's so easy to get down. In fact, I started watching a new show that my, one of my friends, I'm not going to even talk about the name of it, but um, one of my friends recommended it. And she goes, oh, you're going to love it. And literally, it started to bring me down. And so I'm learning in my mental health to not watch or, uh, things that bring me down. So I'm not going to watch that TV show. Um, I've just found that um, it, it brings my mood down and then it brings my whole everything down. So always try to stay positive. And the way I do that is by being in positive places and hanging out with positive people. So the fan page is a very positive place. It's a very happy place. You can find um, prayer requests. You can pray for people. It's just a great place. So I just like to tell you guys all that. But thank you all. So oh, Slimline Storage, Connie, yes. Tiffany texted me today and said, when are you going to have it? And I said, my love, as soon as they send it to me. Yes, Slimline Storage is coming. It's going to be an awesome, awesome bundle that Crafters has put together exclusively for us. Um, I sent an email again today saying, when am I going to get it? So hopefully very, very, very soon, but yes. Okay. My friends, 
Teresa says, same here. Stephanie hates shows that bring me down. Yeah, I seriously, I, you, you know, we got to stay sane, right? And we got to stay happy. So my friends, thank you. You guys all make me happy. So thank you all so much. Thank you for your love, your support, and your prayers. I appreciate each and every one of you. I appreciate the community that we have built. And I just want to say thank you. So have a great, safe, happy, safe, stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy. And I will see you Thursday for a crafting corner at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. And, oh, pretty soon, a couple more days, we're releasing that new class. It's going to be awesome. Okay, take care. Love you. Bye.